Recapping your top stories this hour, London police have confirmed that at least 12 people have died after a fire engulfed a block of flats in North Kensington. The death toll is expected to rise further as recovery efforts continue. The London Ambulance Service says more than 70 people have been hospitalized, 20 are in a critical condition. Clouds of smoke are still pouring out of that 24-story building. A top U.S. Republican and his aides have been shot in Virginia. Steve Scalise was taking part in a baseball practice session in Alexandria, Virginia, when the multiple shooting took place. U.S. President Donald Trump has issued a statement confirming that the suspected assailant has died. Trump also says the injured congressman is in a stable condition. Egypt's parliament has approved a water border agreement with Saudi Arabia. It divides the Red Sea region between the two countries, transferring the contested islands to Saudi Arabia. On Tuesday, dozens of journalists and activists protested against the parliament's decision to look into the matter, despite a court ruling. And the ICC trial of Congolese warlord Bosco Ntaganda will continue tomorrow. Earlier, lawyers argued that the former M23 commander has no case to answer to. Ntaganda faces several charges of war crimes and crimes against humanity, linked to the murder, rape and recruitment of thousands of child soldiers and sex slaves between 2002 and 2003. Ntaganda has pleaded not guilty to all charges. And those are the stories we're following this hour.